the cover they tried on you tonight, the first time they really trapped somebody, uh, even after a ball screen, and how'd you assess? I've seen that uh, already. I already know that. So we, had, we, had this, we had this conversation earlier. And, I mean, I've seen that defense uh, several times over the course of this year, and it's no different. You seem like that you're just constantly on that on that roll. What is it like to just stay in that rhythm? Just being that? aggressive. Being aggressive and trying to do whatever it takes to help my teammates. Gerald said the other day that he feels like he's really locked in. Why are you so locked in now? I'm, sure I'm always locked in, but I mean, it's, uh, it's an opportunity, you know, especially coming off last year and the momentum we had and uh, to get off to that slow start, you know, being injured, you know, and trying to bounce back. Uh, I feel like I got some making up to do, so uh, I want to get back to a rhythm and put ourselves in the best position and uh, compete. What do you feel like was the difference in the fourth quarter, James? Our defense. Third quarter, we allowed them uh, to get too many easy layups. We kind of relaxed. I think, you know, being up 18, you know, late in the third quarter, uh, we got to close those games out, go 20, and uh, cruise the fourth quarter. But, you know, give a team confidence, especially a young team. They got a lot of energy. Um, you know, they made some big shots, turned the ball over, and, and we had to kind of calm down a little bit. But uh, we closed the game all the right way. What does it mean to you that Will Chamberlain was the only guy who's had a longer scoring streak of 30 points or more than you? Um, great company. I mean, I have a book. They had a 500 games over 30. Um, I'm just trying to continue to keep going. Like, nothing can slow me down, nothing can stop me. Uh, I'm trying to give that same courage and same motivation to my teammates. Um, and it's not just about scoring, it's about just going up here and attacking the game. Like, right. like like being aggressive with the game of basketball, defensively, offensively, um, that's, all I can, that's all I can give to him. You got to be without Chris for a while. How nice is it when you know you can put the ball in his hands and he can, he can I mean, it's just unbelievable. But then you got Eric that set out tonight. So right. once we get it you know, together, we get all our pieces together and being able to catch a rhythm, um, the game will be a lot more easier for us.